Hello, my beautiful beauties and my wonderful lovelies. A pleasant morning to you, beautiful people. You know, I hate injustice. For those of you who have been watching me over time, you know that I hit out against injustice, unfairness, and inequality where inequality should not be. Because all three uh, elements, they are different. There are some things where inequality is not necessary. All right, but injustices, mm -mm, I hate it with a passion. So I was looking at the food and um, agricultural organizations post, I don't know if it is today, it came out, where a study was done you know, by this team from the United Nations where 2 million Jamaicans cannot afford um, a healthy diet. They cannot. So when people are saying, oh, them go and buy the big box lunch because of what them can afford, the 300, 400, or 500, whatever the minimum amount is for a box lunch, I know them start to make them as small as the cake size boxes, not the coffin one that they call long ones. 2 million, you know what it costs to have a healthy diet? $1,025 per day. $1,025 per day. And remember, a lot of Jamaicans still take public transportation. So when sometimes people talk about people living above means they don't have nothing to even live above or below them, way below. They can't even reach it even if they wanted to. Sometimes I think we allow a sense of self-righteousness to be the order of the day. Yes, some people probably um, live above their means, because they really do not understand financial management. I didn't. It is until I read Ecclesiastes 11, I understood it and some other books. People don't know it is like learning literacy. You have to have finance. You have to be taught financial literacy, whether indirectly or directly, you have to be taught. 67% of our Jamaican people cannot afford a healthy diet. They cannot afford it. it has nothing to do with stewardship, budgeting, whatever. Because we are poorly, poorly paid. We are. That is why we can't afford housing, proper housing. Our salaries are way too low. I mentioned years ago, I heard a minister with my own two ears saying, anyone earning less than $500,000, I don't know if it is gross or net, but I'm assuming he was even referring to net, are barely scraping. I'm still earning less than that. What, what, what are we talking about? Public sector workers are poorly, poorly paid. That is why you have them arms striking. You no, know, they can't manage anymore. One lady said they're eating kiss cake and soda for lunch. Then they must develop all kinds of sickness and diseases. So by taking that, I must say, want them won't get rid of poor people, annihilate them. <laughs> Bible said the poor you'll always have with you, guys. I want to know, wake up and see what is happening. Follow me on TikTok, subscribe to my YouTube channel, and share this.